Yeah, Deputy O'Brien's bill certainly reflects widespread concern in this House and society at large. Uh, in relation to bullying, and I believe that the action plan on bullying due to be published in the coming days will address those concerns uh, comprehensively. Uh, this action plan has been produced by the Anti-Bullying Working Group, which was established in June uh, last year following a very successful anti-bullying forum set up by Minister Quinn and Minister Fitzgerald uh, in response to a request from the National Anti-Bullying Coalition. I was happy to have been instrumental in the establishment of that particular forum. Uh, I've worked closely with uh, that organisation since its inception, and in their visits to Dáil Éireann and presentations to members, they've brought home to us the horrendous cost uh, human costs of bullying. Uh, I don't, don't think anybody has heard the first-hand testimony of people like Jeremy Prince or Jonathan Pugsley on their visits to this house who lost their children to suicide. Could be in any doubt about the need to strengthen uh, the protection available to our children both in and out of school. Um, in my opinion, it must become mandatory for schools to record incidents uh, of bullying and put in place corrective and most importantly preventative bullying policies. I think it's interesting to note as well, Laskan Corla, that there is a yawning gap between how bullying is treated in the workplace uh, against how bullying is treated in uh, the education system and in a school environment. I think that's instructive. Um, ideally, I think uh, the way to approach bullying should always include parents. Uh, however, I believe schools should have discretion whether or not to inform parents in the cases where such an action could add to the distress of the child. So it is, as Deputy Tuffy has said, a very complex uh, issue. In her definition of bullying, Professor O'Moore of Trinity College stressed the repetitive nature of the act, something I note that, in fairness to Deputy O'Brien, he also includes in his uh, definition. Uh, Professor O'Moore also emphasises the need to adopt a holistic approach to tackling the problem, and we know it's not possible to simply tackle one form of bullying and then come back to fix the rest. Thank there must be know. an underlying philosophy and guidelines which can then be adjusted to tackle bullying in all its different manifestations, uh, whether it be racism, homophobia, tar targeting of those with disabilities, or simply targeting the child who wears, in somebody's opinion, the wrong clothes uh, or listens to the wrong music. And I look forward very much, last concord, to the action plan to be published shortly as another positive step in protecting Thank you, our children.